Hi, it's Harry from Williams Crawford. Today we've got a very special video. We're going to be with our local BMW fanatic, Beth, talking about this very special car down here, which we'll get into in just a second. Hi, my name's Beth. Um, fanatic, that's one way of putting it, I suppose. When we do have any sort of BMW come in, um, I do, it is normally, Beth, what's this? Um, so here we have this lovely Z4M in Imola Red. Um, it's on an 06 plate. And I think the first thing you can't help but notice is how good it looks for an 06 Absolutely. plate car. Um, <laughs> This car's only three years older than me. I don't know, you can say who's aged better in that time, but for considering the age of it, it does not look out of place on today's road at all compared to what we're, other vehicles are on the road. Definitely. So, so we've got here a standard Z4, this one being a Z4M. Can you tell me some of the differences? Okay, so the first thing about this car in particular, it is a coupe version. It is not a roadster. Um, but I think the most notable difference, which makes this car so special, is that it's got the S54 3.2 litre um, BMW E40, same engine that was in the E46 M3, which may or may not be one of my dream cars. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think that's really what makes this the car that it is um, under that notable long bonnet um, we've also got the different style bumpers front and rear um, we've got the 19 inch spoke wheels again the color of this car makes it exceptionally rare um, there's not many figures to suggest how many there were but this color was one of the rarest options that they came in yeah i've definitely never seen one in imola red has it got any modifications on it? Yes, so this particular vehicle has got um, Bilstein shock absorbers all round. Lovely. Gives it a really nice low stance, doesn't it? Yeah, it sits absolutely lovely. I'll just shut this door again and you get the side profile. Yeah. Perfect. It is a really, really good looking car. If absolutely. we come round to the rear, it's also got the exhausts. Um, and again, I think it looks good from every angle. Absolutely. Really, really nice car. Do you want to start it up then? Yeah, no problem. What do you think? It is a really nice place to be. For the age of the car, it's simple but effective. Um, it doesn't, you don't feel like you're in an 06 plate car. It has held its modernness. I don't even yes, know. definitely. It really, really well. So I've joined Beth in the cabin now just to go through some of more of the extras. So what have we got? So we've got obviously got air conditioning. Um, the driver's seat is memory seat. Um, and But I think the, the main thing that I really like about the interior of this car is how simple they kept it, but it still looks so good. Definitely. I have a, I have an F31 BMW myself, and the interiors, they just don't seem to age. They continue to look good. Um, this particular car has got, it's been very well looked after, and it's got an extensive history. Um, it's quite an interesting read, if you're as much of a BMW fan as me. Um, so yeah, it's got loads of invoices for all the work that's been carried out Brilliant. on it over the years. Yeah, big history file, definitely. <laughs> We've also got the service book and everything back in the office. Brilliant. So if I wanted to buy one of these, brand new, back in 2006, how much roughly would I have paid for it? Well, in 2006, I was only three, so I don't know how much you can uh, <laughs> quote what I'm going to say, but I think they were around £42,000 new. Um, and I mean, we've got ours up for 19995 wow. so you're getting a lot of yeah. car for your money compared to how much it was. Um, this particular one, I think it's got just shy of over 75,000 miles on yep. the clock. Um, yeah, you, you're getting your 3.2 straight six E46 engine. Oh, it's a brilliant engine, isn't it? In your Z4M. Um, I don't really think you can go too wrong. B road, rear wheel drive, you're going to have a lot of fun. Absolutely. Um, this car also comes with our six month in-house warranty. Um, so yeah, if you would like, if you're interested in it, feel free to give Andy or Ross a call. Brilliant. Thank you for talking to us about that, Beth. No worries Definitely at all. Definitely the BMW encyclopedia <laughs> of Williams Crawford. All right. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you enjoyed hearing Beth talk about this lovely car. We'll see you in the next one.